Hey, it's Amanda. This is my number six Foxy Fix. It's a compact in Boss Babe Madison Avenue leather. And if I don't record a fall flip through right now, one handed, it's just never going to happen. So if you have any questions, let me know. I'll try to link everything below. These are from Shop Fill the Beautiful. A lot of my papers are from Pebbles Inc. Again, I'll link them below. I keep my contact information under here per usual in case, heaven forbid, this gets lost. My dashboards are from the Foxy Fix. Uh, Post-it notes. And this is just a card for my husband. And on the back, I have some Planner Kate stickers that are folded in half. And then this first insert is, I just made it um, with a cover and some extra dot grid I had around. And it is all about our move. We just moved from Missouri to Seattle. So I've got like calendars and budgets and timelines and notes and things that we were going to sell and not sell and what we sold it for and like what's going on right now. Um, we're negotiating house. Everybody, fingers crossed. And the back of that, I just have a quote. And this is the back of the card from my husband, um, a card and some notes from my mother-in-law and my mom. And these post-it notes are available online. And I'm just checking my frozen breast milk. And then this next um, section, this next string, this is a compact, so four strings in case I forgot. Um, this is a pouch from Amazon. And in here, I just have some stamps and return address labels that are no longer relevant. Um, this is from Villa Beautiful. And this is from... Um, sticker Oki. And then on the back, I do use this as my wallet. So this is usually full with my IDs, I have pen on my hand, IDs and um, credit cards. And then my first insert is from Paper and Cats. Taylor used to have a shop name for Sizzle Made and she renamed it to Paper and Cats. So in here is my monthly, which is just like my bread and butter, like very glamorous right now. Hopefully I'll decorate uh, maybe a little Halloween theme soon. Fingers crossed. Here's some random notes about nursing certifications. This is the back of that pouch. It's got a nice zipper. I keep a thank you card in here. These are tabs that are sticky that I'm not using right now. Um, the, the sticker pack was one of my favorites from your studio. Um, and then this next insert on this next string is my daily pages. Also from Paper and Cats on Etsy. Again, I'm really just on the ball this month with planner um, decoration. It's been a mess lately, guys, so bear with me. <laughs> but I use this every day um, for planning and journaling. And then this next section, another Foxy Fix dashboard. Things that are lost, post-it note. And this notebook is, I think I have my cover sheet. Yeah, so this is what's in here on the back of it. Um, I have things written down, but it's got like more personal information. So I keep it covered with this list of things. And I actually ordered... A smaller notebook because this is a 60 page one. I ordered a 30 page notebook from um, Paper and Cats from or yeah from Taylor at Paper and Cats to kind of downsize that because this compact can get kind of heavy. It's not super full, but it can get heavy. Um, back here in the back of this one, these are baby sign language um, cheat sheets, and then I also usually keep my kids' most recent uh, pediatrician visit note cards that have their current height and weight on there as well. And then back here, I have some stickers from Shop Villa Beautiful, Pumpkin Paper Co. I keep business card back here too. And the front is filled with business cards as well. Extra post-it notes. But I love these and I don't write on them. So I should probably switch it out. Um, and then these are my favorite pens. These are High Tech Cs. Um, sorry, it won't focus. Or no, sorry, G Tech. Hmm. Uh, they're from Pilot <laughs> and I love them. It's a 0.4 pen. And then I've also been using a Tombow this month. That's been fun. Let me know if you have any questions. This was really quick, um, but I just haven't really had time to do fun personal things lately. And planning is one of those fun personal things. So let me know if I missed anything and you have any questions. And hopefully I'll be back full throttle soon. Thanks for watching.